this is what it's about. Worked out perfect. Getting all worked up like this. Drive across the country with your best friends. What's up everybody? I'm going to pick up Ryan and we are headed to Wyoming to chase some mule deer. We're trying to get out there for opening day, September 1st, 2022. It's gonna be an awesome adventure. We're gonna be doing some daily videos and uh, hopefully putting some nice mule deer on the ground. Stay tuned, I think you're gonna like what's coming. Guys, made it to Minnesota. Got about uh, 10 hours to go yet. It is 6.45 in the morning. Uh, we're hoping we can make it to our hunt area in Wyoming by four o'clock this afternoon. That's kind of the goal. And uh, that'll give us plenty of time to shoot the bows, make sure nothing's off from travel, and do some scouting, and hopefully locate some bucks before opening day, which is uh, tomorrow, September 1st. What's up guys? Just got to our hunt area. It's the day before the season and uh, we're doing what everybody should do when they go on a cross-country hunting trip and checking the bows, make sure everything's good with them uh, and nothing got knocked off from the from the trip. We're shooting target out behind my shoulder there at uh, 40 yards with a broadhead and a field point and making sure everything's good. You rolling? Oh, I'm rolling. All right. I've been rolling. Always rolling. All right. Morning, day one here in Wyoming. It's about 4.15, sun comes up around 6, so we're up early. We're gonna have a only a couple hundred yard hike uh, to a glassing knob this morning where we saw some deer last night. Probably got in around know, 4 o'clock yesterday, uh, but the deer were moving late, so we didn't see anything until late, so we're gonna hop over here where we saw quite a few does and a forky last night, so. Stay tuned, we'll see what happens, but should be a promising morning. What's up guys, it's about 6.20, uh, pretty much sunrise here. Uh, nothing, no bucks I should say so far. Uh, plenty of buck pronghorn, haven't seen a buck mule deer yet, we've seen a couple does, a group of coyotes, and thousands of cows, but no, uh, no buck mule deer yet. Being the key yet. We're holding out hope. Ryan and I uh, split up. He's on the back side of the point that I'm on so we can see a little bit more. And um, hopefully we can get a buck located. Neither of us are being picky. Anything that forks is getting shot. So that shouldn't be too hard, we think. Famous last words. There's a fork buck a couple hundred yards away.
<laughs> we got a mule Opening deer. morning mule deer with a bow. Opening morning. He's no monster. Last time I came out to Wyoming, I came here for pronghorn. And I passed bucks on the first day that I would have shot on the last day. And I learned a hard lesson that trip to take advantage of opportunity. and back of you yeah and i didn't want to show myself by going up yeah i don't blame you 26 yard shot he went 80 yards maybe maybe <laughs> we got a mule deer to process on day one i got my first mule deer with the bow with the bow <laughs> i'm freaking shaking day one hour and a half in this is what it's about. Worked out perfect. Getting all worked up like this. Drive across the country with your best friends. Dude, that is that is straight hard shot. Zoom in on that. And the VPA looks perfect. Let me get those veins. Coated. right there beautiful that's perfect maybe a touch forward for some guys probably would have preferred right there but I mean not a problem it's not like it mattered oh that's so cool he's got a little bump right here he started shedding a little bit a little bit right here on the back side here. Yeah. Got the hard horn underneath. That's cool. <laughs> Why do so many mule deer have all these tears in their ears? I don't know. I wonder if it's from fences. First mule deer. First day. First day, my first mule deer. First hour of Legal shoot. Unreal. Opening day success, guys. Hunted for an hour and a half. Ryan and I spotted this buck uh, last night, driving around on some public and shedding his summer coat. The winter coat's coming in. You can just pull out the summer hairs. This is uh, my first mule deer. 27 hour drive. And I'm, I'm, I'm real happy. Couldn't have worked any better. Couldn't have worked any better. Walked right to us, 25 yard shot. Double lunged him and he only ran about 80 yards. If that. If that, probably 50, 60 yards. We got about a three quarter mile pack out. And uh, I'm going to take him to the taxidermist, try and get a European mount with the velvet still on. They'll probably give me the fake velvet, but that's fine. My first mule deer. Good one to wet my feet to mule deer hunting. You know, can't come out of the gate shooting 180 inch buck in open country with a bow. I wouldn't be fair. <laughs> so we'll call this putting in my dues. <laughs>